The magic of marriage is in the minutia of everyday life. The errands that need to be run, the tasks that must be completed. A partner who helps you marvel in the mundane and wade through life's checklists with levity marks the difference between the ephemeral and the everlasting. These interstitial moments will join your colorful stitches and make your tapestry more cohesive, more strong, and more beautiful over time. Tiffany and I share a very, very strong bond. Tiffany and I can have a conversation across a crowded room without words. We've always been that way. So to think that somebody was good enough for my baby girl wasn't really in the cards. Then comes Chris. And everything that I would want my daughter to have, she found in him. Tiffany, I keep thinking about our first date and our first weird, wonderful conversation. We talked about anime, about our jobs and families, about death, we kind of covered the whole gamut. I remember thinking that you weren't like anyone I'd ever met. You were so honest and sure in exactly who you were. You were amazing and honestly so intimidating. <laughs> For five years, we've kept that conversation going. In that time, I've come to realize that you're somehow both tougher and kinder than I am. You so naturally make things better around you, as a nurse, as a professor, as a friend, a daughter, and a partner. And your self-assuredness, you've shown me how to see the good in myself. I've heard a lot of people say a lot of nice things about him over the last couple of days. The one word that strikes me about Chris is humble. He is one of the most accomplished but humble young men that I've ever met in my life. I love you and I wish you guys nothing but happiness. I promise to always be your friend and I promise to always stand by your side wherever that takes us. Tiffany, I still can't believe that a random online date has turned into what it has. I can't believe I found someone as strong and beautiful as you, and who loves me as much as you do. Most of all, I can't believe this has been the rest of our lives together. Love you. Love you. As a mother, I've always wanted nothing but love and happiness for my daughters. <laughs> and today, my prayers have been answered. I am so happy for Tiffany and Chris I love them both very much. And now I have a son. <laughs> and to steal a word from my bestie, Denise, she called her daughter-in-law, daughter in love. So I'm gonna call Chris my son in love because love is why I brought them here together. And love is gonna keep them together. The way he lives his values through his work, his job, the way he interacts with his community, his integrity, his sense of loyalty, of right and wrong, the loving way he interacts with those around him, they make him a man and a brother who now I look up to. And so I couldn't be more happy that he has found his equal or really his better in Tiffany. Tiffany has been uh, my best friend since the day that I was born. Words truly cannot express how much love I have for Tiffany. Everybody in this room that knows you is better off for it because you are a person that loves passionately and gives unconditionally. And I always hoped that you would find somebody that would give you that same kind of love. And I'm happy to know that you found that in Chris. And Chris, I'm blessed to now have you as a brother. So please join me in toasting to the bride and groom. Cheers. <laughs> Chris.
Chris. You used to ask me how I was so sure about wanting you, and I'm not sure I ever gave you a satisfactory answer. The simple truth is that being with you is the first time my soul has ever known peace. You are everything I could ever ask for, and thankfully more than I'll ever deserve. I promise you forever. I know loving me is not always easy, and I can't promise you that it will ever get easier. But know this, through whoever you've been, through whoever you'll be, through whatever you do, you will always have me, no matter what. My life simply doesn't make sense without you in it. So I'm going to spend the rest of it loving you as hard as I can. I'm so excited and truly grateful uh, that I get to experience more simple moments, discover more simple truths, and keep my simple promise forever, by your side, as your wife. I love you, and I can't wait to share the rest of our lives together. By the power vested in me, in the presence of God, and the witness of friends and family, it is my privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. You make us the bride.